SAS Factory is a collection of custom SSIS components that replace the need for using script tasks or script components. Within our SSIS components, you will find different groups of components or different types, such as components that will help with connectivity, productivity, and performance. For connectivity, we do offer different types of sources and destinations. For example, here I have a Salesforce source and destination. The Salesforce source will connect to a Salesforce account and it just makes it easier to pull rows out of a Salesforce object. You can also edit the SOQL statement. The Salesforce destination will make it possible to send rows out to a Salesforce object. In the Salesforce destination, you will find the options to insert, update, delete, or even upsert rows, which gives you a conditional insert or update. We also have the SharePoint source and destination. The SharePoint source and destination will connect to a list inside of SharePoint and just allows you to read and write rows from that list. When sending rows to a list inside of SharePoint, you do have the option to create, update, or delete. Amongst our productivity components, you'll find the secure FTP task. The secure FTP task will give you all the benefits and the features of the native FTP task, but it's created specifically for interacting with the secure FTP. In addition to all the native activities, such as uploading and downloading directories and files and creating and deleting directories and files, you also have the option to check for the existence of a file on a server and also getting a list of files on that server. We also have a group of data cleansing components. In our data cleansing category, you'll find a component that will replace unwanted characters We also have the Trim Plus Transform, which will give you the option to trim all leading and trailing white space characters or specified characters. And one of our most popular data cleansing components, the Null Handler. This component will give you different ways of converting nulls and blank values to user-defined values. For our high performance components, we have the upsert destination. The upsert destination is a destination component that will perform a conditional insert or update into a destination table. Just by using an ADO.NET connection manager for batch processing, and then pointing to the table that will be written to, and then selecting exactly what you'd like to do, either inserting or updating or both, which gives you the upsert effect. And you'll also find the Dimension Merge SCD. The Dimension Merge SCD is a high performance replacement for the slowly changing Dimension Wizard in SSIS. The Dimension Merge SCD will take both your source table and your dimension table, merge the data together, and start making its decision on what's a new row, what's an update, and what can be ignored. Inside of the Configuration Manager, you'll find lots of different types of configurations, such as the Row Change Detection, where you can choose to ignore case changes and leading and trailing white space characters. You'll also find different ways of SCD2 date handling. We have different ways of handling the variable that contains the now value, so you'll be able to choose both system and user variables. And there's a few different options for defining how the last record's expiry date will be defined. After configuring this component, you'll notice that it doesn't build out the rest of the package for you, but you can use any type of destination that you prefer. In this example, all of my new rows would be sent to ODB destinations to be inserted, and any of my updated rows will be sent to the upsert destination. Task Factory includes over 50 different tasks and components.